Look here. This is the effect after upgrading 360 safety in the car radio. Not only realize 360 panoramic display, but also can view the image in real time on the phone. In the last video, I have installed 360 module into this PS10 and upgraded the system. What tools do we need to upgrade the system? We need a USB flash disk and computer to complete the city time upgrade. This is the TS10 from last video. It has a system suffix of theme 1. We need to upgrade it to the system with the system suffix of window theme 1 CT. You can download the lastest firmware on our Telegram channel. Choose TS10 firmware channel. Choose the system suffix with window theme 1 CT. How can we find the corresponding system? Here I make a table. You can check it by your car radio platform. Then you can find the correct firmware. Download the system firmware to computer and zip it to the root directory of USB disk. But it should be noted that you must unzip it into the USB disk. Don't drag the firmware into USB disk. If the firmware is not unzipped, the car radio can recognize the upgrade file. After unzipping, plug the USB disk into car radio. The red icon will appear in the upper left corner. It means that USB disk has been read. We look to the car radio. Car setting. System USB disk quick system upgrade. It takes about 5 to 10 minutes to complete upgrade. The car radio will read the upgrade file. TS10 machine has 7 upgrade files. The files will be read one by one. The car radio will reboot after reading them. After rebooting, we can check if system has changed. In car setting, about. If the system suffix has ZT, that means upgrade was successful. Next, we need to get the 360 software on screen. We go into config info to open 360 panorama and reboot the car radio, then 360 software will display on screen. Open 360 safety. First you need to activate the software, enter code to activate. Then our upgrade system is done. If you have any questions or experience during the upgrade process, you can join CarMate Forum to share your ideas. At the end of this video, if the video is helpful to you, you can click a like. Next video, I gonna tell you about 360 software splice method. If you are interested in it, you can subscribe our channel.